My name is Jermaine Jamerson. My name is Hugo Barraza. I am Catherine Peters. I signed up for the military. I, I really wanted to go out and serve my country. I was a staff sergeant in the Air Force. One of my friend's sisters was in the military. She was in the Air Force. And I just started talking to her. And I, at 13, that was it. That's what I wanted to do. We like our vets. I'm Cheryl Black. I'm the Senior Vice President of Human Resources, and we think that our values align a lot with uh, military values. That says a lot about Sunbelt. A lot of my friends weren't able to find a job once they actually got out of the military. Sunbelt does a great thing in looking for veterans and giving them a place to work because it's not an easy road. I do talk to a lot of vets, and that is one thing that um, you know, people do struggle with when they first get out, what they're gonna do. Something near and dear to my heart is how do we integrate veterans back into a civilian workforce? I can sit here, it makes me wanna cry just because I can think of some of the stories. I'll be honest, my transition was a little wild. Um, my, my sister's friend owned a bar, and so she said, you're gonna come and work for me, and I said, okay. And so I went and worked for her for six months and I realized it wasn't, it wasn't me. I was more disciplined than this. I just had to get my life back in order. It was scary in the meantime because I didn't know exactly, hey, what, what am I gonna do? I mean, military was my life, it's who I am. Uh, what, who am I gonna be w without them anymore? And uh, like I said, with Sunbelt, I found my niche. Hi, I'm Brad Lowell with Sunbelt Rentals. I'm the executive vice president. When they speak about the culture of Sunbelt, uh, it's very much genuine in the nature of the family atmosphere that we have here. During my interviews when I came to Sunbelt, everybody asked me, the first question is, tell me about Jermaine and tell me about your family. Family means a whole lot. Being able to see my kids blossom and grow and learn from each other, um, I think is the biggest thing that I like to see and I like to spend a lot of time with them. My family is probably um, my turning point in my whole entire life. They made me want to be a better person, a better man, a better father, they bring out the best in me. People and families are important. There is a sense of family. Um, people care about each other. We have a lot of families that work in the business. We have three daughters. When there's work to be done on the weekends, they come in and help file. My husband will come in and help. It's a family thing, so it's a team effort. Catherine joined us uh, about five years ago, and I remember actually meeting her in Green Bay, Wisconsin. She walked up very confident and stuck her hand out and shook hands and said, Hi, I'm Catherine. I'm going to be your new manager and I'm going to take over Green Bay for the company. And she did just that. It is just such a neat company. And I think one of the greatest concepts that they had is the green equipment. Hugo is a service manager for, for Sunbelt Rentals in the uh, Central Texas market. And he's somebody that has a wealth of experience and knowledge, very focused on the mission at hand. And that's where you want to be as an ex-military you know, military veteran. And I think I just got lucky when I got uh, chosen by Sunbelt. So I met Jermaine a couple of years ago at an um, annual meeting for Sunbelt. And I think the one thing that uh, you'll find about Jermaine is just his infectious optimism and his, his smile and his genuine gratitude for the people around him. Sunbelt does a great job trying to recruit. Um, I think they do a good job of having that being my brother's keeper attitude. We spend a lot of time hiring vets. My goal is to take that step next with Sunbelt and see what we can do uh, to make it easier for veterans to integrate our veterans that are on the inside, see that you know we do have their back and that we do want to extend that olive branch and really reach out to them and say, how can we help you? To be able to serve someone that served us, to me, is where I'd like to be. 